stuck in the car at the moment. Andy picked me up along the road because there's a big hailstorm going on. The weather's like <coughs> changing every 15 minutes. It's rain, now it's hail, now it was sunny, I was sweating, then it was freezing. So that's what it's like on a walk. It's always the same, especially in the month of May. So today's walk is dedicated to Mr. Lou Jibault, Nobel Peace Prize winner, who's been thrown into jail, like so many other innocent people, by the criminal Chinese government. Lu Jibo was just asking for some reforms, actually basically demanding that the laws that are in the Chinese constitution, that they are implemented, but not even that is possible in the cr criminal state of communist China. And it's, uh, it's nice today for me to walk for a Chinese citizen, because the Chinese government, they always like to claim that people who are against or stand up for human rights issues in China are against the Chinese people. Anyone with a brain knows that that's not true. Chinese people are humans like us. And that's why it's good to walk for him today. We should also think about his wife, who's been under, under house arrest for years now. So the, these criminals are running China. They destroy, try to destroy people, destroy families, destroy communities. And they'll do anything to avoid people joining together who have similar views and opinions and standing up against the injustices that their regime is based on. So that's what today's walk's about. So please go to the internet, inform yourself, sign a petition, and basically just think about him today, Luigi Bo and his wife, and all the other innocent people. I'm sitting in the car because it's a little bit of a storm, but what would Luigi Bo, his wife, and all the other innocent people in Chinese hell holes, what would they give to be able to walk in this little storm? express themselves that's a basic human right and they don't even have that so let's think about them today <laughs>